UC Law San Francisco takes its obligations as a public law school seriously and with great intentionality. For instance, our Legal Education Opportunity Program, LEOP, turned 50 in 2019, and we celebrated our 50th anniversary cohort when they graduated. LEOP has become a national model for how higher education can open doors for those not conventionally welcomed into the halls of power and privilege. This year, our first generation program gives us a reason to celebrate another cohort of students who have met and surpassed a specific challenge, the first in their families to go to college and the first to go to law school. Our first generation students comprise approximately 20%, 20% of each UC Law class. To be sure, to be sure, like all of our graduates, they have certainly had the love and support of family and friends who helped them navigate that untrodden path. But being the first to actually walk that path is an accomplishment worthy of special recognition. I now ask those first-gen students in the graduating class to please stand so we can recognize and applaud this great accomplishment. But it is in the face of this difficulty that we discovered our true strength, resilience, and capacity for growth. It is in this journey that we uncovered our hidden talents, untapped potential, and unexplored opportunities. Indeed, the heart is what makes our journey through law school great. The last several years have required not only intellect, but grit, determination, and an unwavering commitment to excellence. But as, but as we cross one finish line, another race begins. Your dream of becoming an attorney is about to be reality. No matter your practice area, you will be lacing up to bring meaningful impact to this world. So, class of 2024, take your mark because you are about to make history. And so now here we are. We've made it to the big stage. We've done all that needed to be done, even at the times when we didn't feel like it. So as we set out to accomplish our next goals, remain committed and disciplined in your pursuit of them because you will only get out what you put in. And tonight, as we witness over 400 individuals graduating from UC Law, ranging in everything from tax to immigration to corporate business, consider how this class can use its commitment and discipline to transform lives, communities, and indeed the world itself. So regardless of your background, be it your gender, race, ethnicity, religion, sexual orientation, or socioeconomic status, we all encounter challenges and we can overcome each and every one of them. So be it a baseball bat, a law degree, or anything else, it is all attainable through hard work. Because in baseball, in law school, and in life, you don't get what you wish for, you get what you work for. Congratulations to the graduating class of UC Law San Francisco. Our law school journey ends today, but the hard work never does. Thank you. Um, and some of you may even continue to feel like an imposter today. You're not even quite sure how you got to this point uh, today. Well, I only have, I have one thing to say to you. This profession needs you. This profession really needs you. You deserve to be here, and we really want you in this profession. And then one last final piece of advice. You came to law school because you're passionate and because you're driven. You survived law school because you're a fighter, because you're resilient. Keep that passion. Keep that fight. Keep that hunger. Go out there and use your head, use your heart, use your hands, get dirty with it sometimes. And you're going to make a mark on this really imperfect but wonderful profession. Congratulations, class of 2024. We are so, so very proud of you. So proud of you. You did it. <laughs>